Hello everyone. Welcome to Aesthetic Food Tech. So in this video, I am going to discuss about hydrogenation and I will be explaining first one what is hydrogenation, second one why fats are hydrogenated, third one how fats are hydrogenated and finally examples of hydrogenation. So let us begin with our first topic. What is hydrogenation? Hydrogenation is a chemical process that add hydrogen to fats with unsaturated fatty acid. This is to make the fats more saturated. In hydrogenation or hydrogenation will first one reduce the number of unsaturated fatty acids in fat and it will increase the number of saturated fatty acids in fat. Next topic why fats are hydrogenated. The degree of unsaturation of fats determine its physical appearance that is whether it is solid or liquid. Presence of unsaturated fatty acids in fats result in the lower melting point of fat. It also make the fat more susceptible to oxidative deterioration. So the objective of hydrogenation is to reduce degree of unsaturation of fats and also to increase its melting point. Hydrogenation also causes changes in the nutritional properties of fats and sufficient hydrogenation make the fat solid at room temperature. Next topic how fats are hydrogenated. Fats can be hydrogenated by careful choice of temperature and catalyst. It takes place in a reactor where hydrogen gas is bubbled. It occurs in the presence of finely powdered catalyst and temperature high as 180 degrees Celsius, usually 0.05% to 0.2% of nickel catalyst is used. Catalyst is finally removed after the process by a process called a filtration and catalyst help to speed up the reaction. Also, hydrogenation of unsaturated fats with catalyst is known as hardening. In hydrogenation process, the double bonds that exist between carbon atoms of unsaturated fatty acids are broken and in that place hydrogen is added. Next topic, examples of hydrogenation. Example of hydrogenation is the hydrogenation of oleic acid. Oleic acid is an unsaturated fatty acid. When oleic acid is hydrogenated, it results in the formation of stearic acid. Stearic acid is a saturated fatty acid. So I have uh, picturized it here. That is oleic acid plus hydrogen gives stearic acid. Here I have given a picture. From this picture, you can clearly see the hydrogenation of oleic acid. When hydrogen is added to oleic acid, then the double bonds are replaced and in that place hydrogen is added and then the oleic acid become stearic acid and become saturated. Soya bean oil, cottonseed oil and palm oil are used for hydrogenation process. The hydrogenation of soya bean oil improves its stability and resistance to the development of undesirable flavor. Margarine, vanaspadi, salad dress dressings, shortenings are examples for hydrogenated fats. Indian vanaspati is prepared by the partial hydrogenation of vegetable oils.